Hey again everyone, it's VN Makeup and I'm going to be doing a October favorites for you today. Uh, just a few items I wanted to mention for this month. Not that much, but there are still some items that I wanted to mention. Um, the first thing is, um, this has probably been in my other videos, but I wanted to mention them again, uh, mention it again because I've been going back to using it starting this month um, and it's the Nivea Soft Moisturizer and it's the Moisturizing Cream um, I love this stuff, I've gone through pots and pots of these um, this is probably my third one that I've used so far and I really like it um, I use it under my primers and under my makeup for every morning and it's just perfect um, it's not too drying and it's not too moisturizing and so it just keeps my face like perfect throughout the day it doesn't get um, oily and um, yeah it just I love it and it smells wonderful so gotta love that um, the next things I want to mention um, are my recent you know they're recent but I already know that I really like them and one of the items I've used before so it is the uh, Forever Makeup Forever um, HD powder and I use this to set my eye makeup um, I don't use it for all over my face but I use it to set my eye makeup and it works like charm um, it works wonders on my eyes and I've worn I've tested out and I've worn it like 12 hours on my makeup my eye makeup and the eyeliner that I was using was the Urban Decay 24-7 and of course we all know that one is like the best eyeliner out there it goes on perfectly but um, it just it just keeps it in color it doesn't go anywhere, it doesn't smudge um, and it doesn't fade even like when I wing out my eyeliners um, I put this on there, it doesn't smudge at all so I really love this for my eyes um, the, another Makeup Forever product that I like is their aqua cream and this is the only one that I have and I think it's the only one that I need um, it's just this perfect color for all over the lid and it's just like a champagne color and um, I love it for all over the lid when I'm in a hurry when I'm just you know rushing somewhere I just kind of dab this on and then put some dark darker color um, in my crease and that's it that's all I have to do don't have to blend much I don't have to do much and even when I'm I've tried it once where I just use a um, I just use an eyeliner pencil and just kind of smudge out my my just kind of do it on my crease and smudge it out over this and it just looks pretty. Uh, I really like that. Another favorite of mine is the Benefits Erase Paste, and this conceals my under eye really well. Um, it it matches my skin perfectly. This is in number two medium. Um, I thought I would be a number one since I'm a little bit thought I was a little bit lighter but I guess not um, this came in the couple kits that I got and it works perfectly so when I'm done with this I will definitely be repurchasing it um, I bought the Boing concealer and I do not like that at all because it's not very creamy for me um, this is much more creamier and it blends much more easier uh, with the Boing um, it had good coverage but it didn't conceal as much as I wanted to um, Yeah. Another favorite item um, of mine that I've been loving and I've been using like almost every day since I've got it and it's the Makeup Forever uh, Dual Matte Powder Foundation and mine is in number 203 and this has such good coverage um, I wanted actually a powder to set my foundation or my tinted moisturizer and I find that this is the only thing I've been having to use I haven't even had to use tinted moisturizer at all um, so I love it and this is all I have on today um, over um, my primer, my Fusion Beauty Primer. So this is all I've been wearing and I am absolutely in love with it. So I'm really glad I got it um, and especially when I got it at the for the family and friends sale for 20% off and it's regular $32. So I'm really loving that. Because I've been looking for a powered powder um, other than the Dream Matte, the Maybelline Dream Matte powder that I've been using um, for a while, and I was just kind of getting sick of it because like it just gets kind of hard up here. So I feel like I'm not getting my product at all. See, like right here, I'm getting the product, but like here, 
I'm not getting the product at all. So, um, yeah, I've been loving this right here. I totally recommend it. Um, another thing that I've been loving is this Urban Decay Baked Bronzer. I've been using this quite often, um, like end of September, beginning of November, uh, beginning of October, kind of. And um, is their baked bronzer in um, toasted? This is called toasted. It it doesn't work as great um, on my skin tone for bronzing, but it just kind of gives me color. Like I use it for giving my face some color. Um, and when I want to contour down here, it is a little bit kind of on the peachier side. So I don't use it for contouring, but um, just for giving me that glow, I do love this. Okay, um, another item that I've been loving is the Benefit um, Stay Don't Stray. I haven't tested it out to see how long it actually lasts compared to the Urban Decay Primer Potion, but I do like the consistency of this. Um, it is thicker than the Primer Potion, and when I put this on, I do feel like... I have something on my lid um, to blend the colors out whereas when I put the primer potion on it doesn't really blend out the color it just kind of help keep the eyeshadows on but doesn't blend it out and uh, it says stay put primer for concealer and eyeshadows so um, I put this on right before I put my concealer on and I guess that's why my erase paste works so well I'm not sure because I didn't try this with the um, Boyne concealer but um, I do like this and the consistency of it, so I'm glad I picked it up. Um, another eye product that I've been loving um, is the Maybelline The Falsies. And I picked this up the same time, sometime beginning of the month, the same time with the Rimmel Sexy Curves. And I prefer this over this um, a lot more because this gives my eyes just, I don't know, it, it, and this is, I got the one in Flared. And it just does wonders. I mean, it really volumizes and curl my lashes or hold my curls. Um, and here's the wand. And it's flexible, so that's really nice. And um, it just gives me a lot of volume and curls, and I like it. Alright, so um, another eye item that I've been loving is this dual um, glue, eyelash glue. I've tried other glues, I've tried different types, and I think this has to be the best one. And I've used, I've had this for a really long time, so the lid works really well. A lot of um, the glues, gl lids just dries up and, you know, your lid, like, gets stuck to the bottle and you can't use it. And um, so I've been loving it. And I've had this for a really, really long time, and I'm pretty sure I'm still going to have it for another very long time. Um, yeah. Another eye item that I forgot to take out, but I'm going to take out, is I've been loving my Inglot eyeshadows. Um, especially this palette right here. As you can tell in the color, it has all different types of colors in here. So when I've been pulling out my um, eyeshadows, like, you know, don't know what color to get, I just pull this out and I have, like, everything in here. Um, oh. And it comes off really easily too. But um, but um, particularly this purple color right here, I've been wearing a lot of purple, and it's just like this creamy purple shade. And then this is like a little bit darker purple shade. Love, love, love those colors. Um, yeah. So I've kind of fixed this palette to the way that I've liked it. I've taken out all the colors with the shimmers and put them in my 10 palette. Um, and then these are all just matte and pearl colors, so love those. Uh, I'm not too much of a shimmer person, so I, I'm pretty happy with the ones that I have in here. Um, another, sorry for my reach, another thing that I've been loving um, that I've been kind of like looking back at and kind of just reaching for it more now that I have my vanity and everything's available to me um, are my Hip Duo eyeshadows and I have it depotted. Um, the color that I've been using the most is this darker color right here in um, the Duo called Saucy 
and it's just this great like burgundy brownish color it's great for the crease love that color and um, also I've been using this pink down here it's um, this light pink here in Rascal can't really see it but it's just that pink right there been loving that color um, so I've been reaching for this palette a little bit more well not palette but yeah it is a palette since I've depotted almost most of the ones I have in here um, yeah so I've been loving that another item that I've been loving is this face brush right here and it's the large angle contour F40 by Sigma um, I've been using this a lot for contouring and uh, for my bronzers so I've just been loving this brush um, also I've been loving my Kabuki brush my MAC um, 181 and this is the limited edition um, I've been using this for my blush I try to use um, this right here for blush but I found that it doesn't work as well but I did find a new thing that I've been loving this for today and it's for my powder to go under my eyes and um, I use that to put on the um, HD and this go really really well together so I've been loving it um, I was using it for cream blushes and they do work well for cream blush but I also like it for putting on my powder so those are the blush brushes I've been loving and um, finally the last thing I want to mention is this NARS uh, nail polish and it's in poker face love this color I love the consistency of it I love their um, packaging and it goes on so smooth and you don't even need a top coat when you put this on um, I put this on in two layers and that was it that was all I needed any top coat or anything like that um, yeah so that's all for my October favorites and I think I've mentioned everything that I wanted to um, yeah, so uh, that's all for my October favorites. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And uh, if you have any questions or comment, please leave them below. Um, and if you have October favorite videos, and please leave video comments below. I'd love to watch um, favorites video because that's when I get to know some of the products. So, um, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you again next time. Bye.